What's up everyone, this is Bricks for you, and today I have a very cool Mega Block set. Let me just start cutting into this box right now. This is a shipping box, and yet it looks so, so cool. We're going to take a look at it at the end of the video, but uh, I just want to get into the set right now. I've been waiting for this. Uh, really, really excited for this. I'm going to be displaying most of my... Mega Halo around this set in a different way than you expect. And the box is thwarting me as usual. Where's some tape? Let me just get into. Ironically, if I use the knife, this would have been easier. Okay, come on. Okay, well, I just messed up the shipping box, but it's, you know, it's a shipping box. I'm gonna get rid of this box. Uh, just because, I mean, it looks cool, but it's, you know, not as cool as possible. Okay, let's just get that, and if you follow Mega, you already know what's in here. I mean, if you clicked on this video, you already know what's in here. But it's the Traxxas Flood Gate Firefight. I was really, I'm really excited for this. Now, what I'm going to be doing with this set, personally, is actually displaying my UNSC with it. Um, not as a battle, but yeah. I'm going to be getting right into this. I'm so excited. I swear I'm working on El Dorado. I swear. I actually haven't opened it yet, but uh, I swear I'm going to get to it, okay? D don't worry. Don't worry. Actually, you might worry. Yeah, that's a better idea. Now I'll get right into it. I'm not entirely sure where to begin with this, but I'm just... Let's just look at the figures first. So we have a bunch of little popcorns. Yeah, they're the same ones in the blind bags. I've looked at these before. Nothing too special there. The coolest figure in the set by far is Halo 3 Master Chief with the flood blood all over. And also this flamethrower that looks so, so cool. Wish there was a flame piece included, but uh, as a LEGO fan, I have more than enough flames flying around. I just love all the flood blood and you know, all around him. That just looks so, so cool. And then we have the tank form. This almost doesn't even look mega. This just, I don't even know how to say it. It's just, it's so cool. It's just a unit. <laughs> Absolute unit. But, uh, there's this very big fleshy arm and a smaller, a little arm, you know, little flood hair. I don't even know what, what words to say. This just looks so cool. Of course, this one just massive foot. Put him to the side. Then we have these uh, two elite combat forms. I forget exactly what they're called, but uh, flood combat forms, whatever. I really love just how they captured it so well. With, you know, the head to the side, the uh, like cracked armor look. It just it's so so good. Uh, of course, obligatory plasma pistol and plasma rifle, and of course the uh, necessary flood arms. Let's put those to the side, and then let's just start. Looking at stuff, so we have this crate, which has two magnums in it. Uh, really, really glad they just, you know, it's good to have little crates like that. Here we have a weapons rack, and now this is going to spark an argument, for sure. But uh, assault rifles on one side, and battle rifles on the other. So, are you a battle rifle gang, or assault rifle gang? Personally, assault rifle and campaign, any day. Battle rifle and multiplayer. But uh, it's it's definitely not the uh, M14 versus Olympia gang argument. But uh, here we have one of the turrets. I really love the look of this. This is going to be really cool. The build I do with this. Um, I mean, I should say the display I do with this set. If you just heard, that was just my cat. I just quickly petted him as he was running by my leg. Here's a bunch of sandbags and really cool design. Not sure what this is going to do against the flood, but uh, you can always hit them with it. Just saying. Then we have this tiny little barrier. Not much, but it's honest work. Then we need to grab the... Uh, very cool shipping container. Come on, buddy. Come on. Oh. Inside, we have another crate. It's a very big crate this time. Which has a shotgun and a spunker. Really good weapon selection in this set. I'm very happy about that. As you can tell, uh, I have a couple parts on this 
said they're not pressed down as much as they should be. This doesn't worry me too much because I'm actually going to be disassembling... Not the whole set, but I'm going to be disassembling that side and part of this side. Because I'm basically, I want to mirror that side to this side. Because so I'm going to be putting this on a shelf in such a way that I'm going to want this to be on that side. But I want this door to be visible. And, but you can see in the back, the, uh, of course, the connector from between the rooms. And you can unfortunately not send your forklift through. But this does mean Master Chief is forklift certified. So we have this... Little forklift, big wheel in the front, little one in the back. You can lift that up. The uh, roll cage can lift up. There's two little lights, two little sticks inside. Very basic, but very, very cool. We have these lights right here. As you see, it says O2. There's a health pack. There's uh, one of the throwy things, fusion coils, fusion coil over there. Cone, barrel. Of course, you have this. You can adjust how much comes down. We have a wooden crate here. We have another thing right here. Another crate. These crates are actually rubber, which is really interesting. Let me just uh, move my camera down. Rubber. There's a little skull back here. You know, and I think that almost is an oddball skull. Uh, gas can. Barrel. And yeah, you have a little Traxxas and a little forklift. Yeah. It's a very nice overall playset, but of course, my big question. What? Okay, well that just happened, okay. My big question is, warthogs. How many warthogs, wart, oh, war, wart, wart. How many wart warts can I fit in here? Just became an elite. Okay, Halo Infinite wart wart. Uh, the Halo Wars Warthog. And then where do I... Do I have a mongoose? Anywhere easily accessible here. I think that's pretty good. I think that's conclusive evidence. That means I give it a... Uh, two Warthogs and one mongoose out of Pelican. So yeah. Thank you all for watching, and good.